Hello there, everybody. My name is MJ and welcome to another episode of Pokemon Fire Red. All right, last time left off, we caught Articuna of the Seafoam Islands, and now in this video, we're going to be moving on to another optional dungeon. That's uh, that's also going to be really cool. So let's do that. Do 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 do. Do, 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 do. I think that guy's a trainer, but I'm not gonna worry about him, so let's just go inside. Alright, welcome to the power plant. Alright. Uh, new Pokemon you can actually find here. You can find Magnemite, Magnetons, and Electabuzz. Um, that's really cool. Alright, and sometimes you can find uh, fake items, and fake and the fake items contain a Voltorbs or Electrodes. Uh, so that's, uh, you want to be careful with that. Now, I don't know, now, I actually, uh, have not been in the power plant in a while, so this is gonna take some time for me to actually remember how to get through this place, so, don't worry about that. I think that is a fake item, so I'm actually just gonna just, wor uh, not worry about it. Uh, so, let's see. Uh, over here, we can grab the... If I can actually get it, this is TM25 for Thunder. Uh, really good electric move. It has 75. It is a 70% chance, but uh, it has 70% accuracy. But uh, if uh, it is raining, it'll always hit. So that's actually really nice. Oh, what? Okay, that's annoying. I uh, don't like that. So let me uh, just fix that real quick. There we go. Ah, freaking electrodes. Okay, here's a Thunderstone. So that's uh, actually a really... That's, that would be pretty good. Starting to run out of Repels, but that's fine, because I, I still have Super Repels and Max Repels to use up as well. Actually, I think... Actually, yeah, let's go over there. I want to go over there. Yeah, see see what I mean? I have not been here in a while. So this, this does take time, time to actually get used to this place. Again. Uh, I've not pra I should have practiced this place, but obviously I did not. Go over here is TM70 for Protect. I already have that TM, but that's fine. And over here is Luxor. All right. Do, 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 do. Okay, so got two more repels left, but that's fine. I believe we are going back, so we're going to uh, now continue where we originally were. All right, so I believe we got to go up here. Man, repel really wears off that fast in here? Are you serious? And then you go down this way. Uh, can I get it? Okay, here we go. That, see, see, I knew they wouldn't really put that area there for uh, for no reason. Alright, and... Wow, really? We got to this place that quickly? Okay. Uh, but, uh, yeah, here is, uh, another one of those, uh, legendary bird Pokemon. And this is an exit, which in the first generation, there was not a second exit. There was not an exit. You pretty much had to go all the way to the entrance, but... Anyway, uh, if you're ready, you wanna save, and then we shall... Okay, this is Zapdos, level 50, electric flying type, with the moves Thunder Wave, Detect, Agility, and Drill Pack. Alright, uh, so, Drill Pack is a, is a pretty, is a very powerful, um, fight move, or I mean, uh, flying, flying move. Um, Detect, uh, Detect always goes first, prevent, uh, preventing you from attacking it. Uh, agility raises speed by a lot, and Thunder Wave just paral paral just straight out paralyzes you. So, um, all right, uh, Zapdos is a really good special attacker. However, it does. However, uh, he does not have a this, this. However, this this Zapdos does not have a special attack, so you kind of want to teach it it. Um, so that's really nice. Uh, which is actually which an electric flying type. That's actually a really good combo. So that, especially since it is an electric type, and plus it will not get affected by by any ground moves, ma making it having very minimal weaknesses. Um, 
So let's see. Uh, let's go for bites because I I believe if I use shockwave that will. Oh, okay. There we go. So that is nice. So I think we can now catch it. I think this is good enough for for, for me to catch it. So we are going to. And yes, I did buy some more uh, ultra balls off screen because I will need it. And and since that's all the, the and since this is all I'm gonna be doing, I guess I'm gonna let you guys, like usual, enjoy the show. That was a lot easier than catching Articuno, because when I recorded the last episode, that took me three tries. One of the legendary bird Pokemon, while it is flying, it makes crackling and snapping sounds. It took me three recording tries to actually uh, catch Articuno, because it just won't catch. I, it, I just ran out of all my Pokeballs just for Articuno. That is stupid. So anyway, uh, the uh, third legendary uh, Pokemon is actually not the third out of the three. Uh, the uh, third legendary bird Pokemon is actually not in uh, in Kanto. So we're gonna actually have to find it the hard way. Well, Bill, a couple episodes ago, uh, invited us to take to uh, somewhere. Let's see if the third legendary bird Pokemon is actually held there. Sure, we're gonna set sail to one island, cause let's do that. Now, once you do this, you cannot go back for a while. Just saying. All right, let's do this. And we're on a boat. All right, this is one island. There, there are several. There are several islands. All right. Huh. All right. Well, let's go see Celio. Oh my gosh! Listen to this music. So this is Celio. He is uh, one dedicated PC maniac. Ah, oh, nice. Huh. All right. What? Huh. There's another island called Two Island, and there's a guy that runs the game corner. So there is another game corner that we have to go that we have to go to. Okay. Well, this is actually a required thing in the game, so we gotta do it. And like I said before, once you uh, once you uh, set once you set over here, this is actually known as the Sevi Sevi Islands. Um. So uh, by Sevi Islands, there are seven islands to go through, and we ha and we actually have to do this. So, and we actually cannot go back to Kanto at the moment. So we'll explore the Sevi Islands next time. And and I and once again, I apologize if this episode was shorter than than usual. <laughs> 